Who knows, maybe my silence is my doom. As, um... As su the suicide machines say, Your silence equals your death! Your silence equals your death! Very nice, uh, kind of metalish sounding song. And if you like, um, punk rock and ska music, as much as I do, then you might really enjoy the suicide machines, because that is pretty much what they are. They are punk and ska infused in an extremely well-balanced manner. Sure, some songs are pretty much pure ska and some songs are pretty much pure punk, but what are you gonna expect? I mean, they're no Operation Ivy, but really, who even comes close to Operation Ivy in terms of punk and ska? Am I right? <laughs> you don't know what I'm talking about, do you? Everybody, if, if there were an audience watching this uh, Let's Play and it was like a live audience, they would just be shaking their heads like, Anyway, we're back in the castle. The actual crazy castle. You gotta wonder, this is a very com complexly sh Complexly? Ugh. Very complex, funny shaped castle. There we go. You gotta wonder, who is the designer behind this? Who is the mastermind? I know it's not gonna be Bugs Bunny or Daffy Duck or someone at the end holding the paintbrush going, ain't I a stinker? Because that would be a cop out. Although for the time it was extremely original. What's not extremely original is me beating these levels, because seriously, it's becoming old hat now. Ah, oh, we're back in the bungalow. And I'm back in the saddle again. I'm back! Aerosmith for ya. I should be mentioning more bands that I listen to. Like, uh, let's see if I can name one band from every letter of the alphabet. So let's see, there's, uh, and, you know, just if I forget, like, one of my favorite bands or whatever, or I don't mention a band I should have, you know, then, oh well, I'll just kick myself later. I should really go down this way. But let's see, A will be for Avail. Um, I should really use the boxing glove on this fella. Probably shouldn't have done that, but meh. Anyway, so A for Avail. Let's get up here. Oh, gosh. This might have been a mistake. A for Veil, let's see. B for, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll try to name some more popular ones that people know. Bouncing Souls. C, uh, The Clash, my favorite band, Evar. Um, D, let's see. Um, the Dance Hall Crashers. Yes, I listen to them. They're very nice. They have a nice infusion of ska, some punk, and even just some plain old pop rock. Um, e, uh, Embrace. Very good, um, I think they're considered like a proto-emo kind of thing. But you know, this is back when, before emo was even a glint in somebody's eye. And by that I mean, you know, tearful, crying eye, because God, emos. Am I right, people? So anyway, uh, let's see, that was E for Embrace. Oh, that's also Ian McKay's, um, band, one of Ian McKay's bands that he did. The other was, um, Minor Threat, but that won't be my M, now that I've mentioned it, uh, post thing. Come on. F, uh, let's see, Flogging Molly, some very good Celtic punk. Yes, I got him. Um, G, Good Riddance. I would have said Green Day, but, you know. Good riddance, uh, that's very nice, fast punk. H, Hostage Life, excellent punk music from, I'm, I'm keep thum I keep giving the thumbs up when I shouldn't be because you can't see it. Excellent uh, punk rock music from, uh, from Toronto, which is about six hours from here, but what are you gonna do? Um, let's see, this is very risky. Um, I, they're not punk rock, but I'm gonna say Iron Maiden, because I like Iron Maiden. Oh wait, I have one, Iron Chic. Chic as in popular and, you know, like geek chic. Uh, let's see, what else? Uh, J, Jawbreaker, good classic punk. K, um, geez, I'm trying to think here. Um, anything for K. 
Nothing really. Oh! I had more? Oh, this is what the pause menu is, by the way. And it starts the music over again. And it also makes me die in a horrible, fiery, explodey death. I wonder where that last carrot was. Oh, it's probably over by Daffy Duck on the right hand side. I should really go get that one. Oh, Daffy Duck. Yeah, let me guess, you're not gonna come this way, are you? Oh, I should sneak around and get it now. <laughs> Let's see, for K, um, I've got a bunch of Konami stuff. I, actually, I should go get the Konami code, because apparently they're a really good uh, uh, video game cover band. But, uh, let's see. I'll probably think of something after, you know, afterwards. L, um, Lars Fredrickson and the Bastards. Some nice old, old-fashioned kind of rock and roll style uh, punk rock. And uh, Lars Fredrickson is um, one of the guitarists and main singers of Rancid. So everybody knows Rancid. Um, let's see, where were we? M? I'll say, um, I have tons for M, but I'll say Misfits? Sure, why not? Everybody knows Misfits. Um, nice old uh, horror punk, I guess they were called. Let's see, uh, N? Oh, what do I have for N? Uh, this, is, this is awfully hard, you know, just off the cuff. Oh boy. Ah, oh, I couldn't make it up there. Mm. You know what? While I'm thinking about it, I'm actually gonna go look into my... I got my iPod right here. I'm gonna go look up N. Just so I can give you some good stuff. Let's see, uh... Oh, no trigger. No trigger, very good. I, I, I knew there was an N band that I wanted to mention. I actually, uh, in one of my, uh, my, in the birthday video I did for me, the one where I'm <laughs> shirtless the whole time, and I'm screaming and blah, 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 that is no trigger. Very good punk band. And don't worry, I'll get back to the game when, when I can. But yes, no trigger for N. Oh, um, I'll say this. Um, back in the day, I listened to Oasis, and I still listen to them, actually. Even though that's, you know, not all that relevant. But, whatever. Um, let's see, I'll say... O. Um, off with their heads? Sure, why not? Off with their heads. Um, and, you know, offspring and whatnot. Oh, come on, can we make it over here? Oh! I almost got hit by that uh, no carrot sign. I forgot about that. Let's see, what else can we muster up? Come on, Gray Sylvester, don't you dare let me down. And I think this is the last carrot here. Let's see, for P, I'll say Pennywise. Because everybody knows Pennywise. Um, or Propagandi. Pro I'll say Propagandi, actually, because Propagandi, probably one of the best, if not the best, uh, Canadian punk band from Winnipeg. Um, Q? Um, I don't actually own any Q bands but I'll say the Queers, because apparently they're extremely good. Um, I have listened to a couple of their tracks and they are actually quite good. Um, R, um, um, Rancid, I guess. Uh, I don't know, the Real Mackenzie's are actually pretty good. Um, yeah, yeah, let's go get this carrot over here. Now that this uh, safe is not all that safe. And yeah, you just keep having fun there, uh, Green Sylvester. Oh, I really want that. No, what? I didn't collect it? Oh, God. 